Good afternoon class, Kim Miner here. I hope you're all staying cool in this Georgia heat if you live here with me. In Neil Postman's book, Amusing Ourself to Death, I have to say I did have trouble reading the book a little bit. Um, after reading and watching the video lectures, I did come to understand a little bit more, I believe, of what he was trying to say. Um, I understand the medium is the message and I understand what that means, talking about all the different ways ever since the beginning that we've been able to have um, information given to us. Um, I believe printed words to telegraph, photography, and video has all been a medium that is used to inform us. Um, and when he talked about the peekaboo world, that was rather interesting to me, talking about television and the instant flashes of images that we see and how they can affect and um, put impressions upon us. Um, and I, th I found very interesting Neil Postman where he talked about um, Marshall McLuhan's teaching of the clearest way to see through a culture is to attend its, to its tools for conversation and I believe that over the past years that we have had a um, interesting improvement in technology I also see how technology um, hinders and hurts us as people um, each medium for example um, speech typographical radio television all makes possible a unique made made of discourse by providing a new orientation for thought and expression of sensibility quoting postman from his book um, visual medium has become the death of the family in my opinion while it is mentioned that postman doesn't believe the television has made our world stupid i would like to say perhaps it has hindered our learning on to an extent um, generally, I feel that you learn so much more if you were to sit and, and read a book and use your imagination. That's what I always try to tell my children. You can go anywhere you want if you read a book. Um, I think if you sit and you just watch a video, it's almost to a point where you veg out and you don't even have to think about anything that's going on. Um, in addition, I found that in the book where he... Um, Postman talked about um, back in 1985 the age of show business um, I think today it's so much more than that and I don't know if, if Postman could have imagined um, in his thought of age of show business as to my thought is everyone wants to show your business I believe that um, we must be very careful in what we watch and hear um, it's no different today than in the past as we as Christians should always pay close attention to what we read or hear, listen, see. The power of the enemy is strong and he will put things in front of us to turn us away from God. Things that may be more entertaining and easier to hear than what God wants us to know from his word. One of the most interesting things that I was reading when they were talking about um, entertainment I believe some of our churches today have turned to a pure entertainment plot in their services. Um, I know personally I left a church due to that. I um, don't personally care for smoke and fog and concert lights during a church service, but I do feel that having a calm um, environment without all the noise helps you get ready to prepare yourself for the word of God that you're going to hear in a preaching. Um, in all of the ways reading from Postman's book about um, typography and telegraphy, I think sometimes we don't think about those forms of communications because they weren't things that were that relevant to us in, in our life now. Um, focusing on photographs, um, and video, I think that we have to really pay close attention to what, what it is that we're listening to, seeing, and um, just to be careful and not have Satan attack us that way. Um, I think social media is a downfall for our world today. While it can be convenient to know what's going on, 
you have to be very careful because most things, a lot of things on social media or even in our news is not true or only per, only portrayed to a certain amount um, of information that maybe that's all they want us to hear but we don't always get the whole story so always pay close attention and do research if something doesn't quite sound right to you class i hope that you have a great weekend and i hope you finish out this class well